families, thank you so much for tuning in to this edition of Coley Cast. This is the very first edition of the 2016-2017 school year. And if you've never watched a Coley Cast before, if you are new to Alta Murrieta, Coley Cast is my monthly video message to the Alta community, where I talk about news and events and information that families need to know. So if you're new to Alta, Number one, welcome. We are so glad to have you. I am super excited about this coming school year. And if you are returning to Alta, welcome back. So let's jump right on in. Uh, like I said, we are two days into the school year as I am recording this. And so far, we have had a wonderful school year. So I am super, super excited about what's to come. Couple of announcements about what we have coming up on the calendar uh, in the month of August. First of all, big event, back to school night for grades first through fifth grade. Kindergarten already had their back to school event before school started, but back to school night for first through fifth grade is Thursday, August 18th. And we will begin the night at 545 out in our quad area where we typically do our Friday flag assemblies. At 545, we'll kind of have a welcome and we will introduce all of our teachers. We have some new staff members, so let uh, everyone be introduced so we know exactly who is on our staff. And then you will have the option. We have two sessions, a six o'clock and a 650 session. The teachers will be giving their classroom presentation twice. So if you wanna to come to the six o'clock session, you can do that. Or if you'd prefer to come to the later session, you can do that at 6.50. So again, a six o'clock and a 6.50 session. Uh, the one uh, thing that you wanna know though, if you are a fifth grade parent, the fifth grade teachers during the first session at six o'clock are going to be going over in the new multi-purpose room their Pathfinder Ranch presentation. Our fifth graders take a trip to Pathfinder Ranch. They'll be talking about all the information regarding Pathfinder during the first session in the new MPR, and then during the second session at 6.50, they will be doing their classroom presentations in the classroom. So once again, for all the other grade levels, you can choose whichever one you want. We have a six o'clock and a 6.50 session. Once again, Thursday, August 18th. So we hope to see you there. Couple of PTA events coming up too. Tuesday, August 23rd is our first family food night. And this one's gonna be held at Wings and Things here in Murrieta. And it's tentatively scheduled from four to 8 p.m. So look for flyers coming home regarding that. But our PTA family fun food nights are where we have local community events where we go to different restaurants and if you dine at those establishments that night, we receive a portion of the proceeds which really benefits our PTA. So Tuesday, August 23rd, Wings and Things in Murrieta, tentatively scheduled from 4 to 8 p.m., but look for a flyer coming home for uh, about that. And finally, our PTA Family Fun Movie Night. We do two of these a year one at the beginning of the year and one at the end of the year. And our first one is coming up on Friday, August 26th. If you have never been to a family fun movie night, it's awesome here at Alta. Out on our field area, we have a little slope. And what we do is we bring in an outdoor uh, screen, a movie screen. And what parents can do is they can bring beach chairs, blankets, lawn chairs, and kind of set up on the slope area. And we project an outdoor movie on a huge outdoor screen. We open the gates at 6 p.m. and the movie will typically start at about sundown. So a little bit before eight o'clock. There will be, it's free to everyone coming. We typically do have we have free popcorn as well, and we usually will have some food for sale, whether it's pizza, things like that. Once again, you can look for a flyer coming home, but mark your calendars. Family Fun Movie Night is Friday, August 26th, opening the gates at six o'clock. Movie typically starts at sundown, so a little bit before eight o'clock. And the movie, which movie are we showing? That will be announced shortly, so look for information coming home. Couple other, couple other announcements that I wanted to talk about. For those of you who are new to Alta or returning, I'm gonna be trying something new this year. And if you have ever gotten a call from the principal, if I've ever had to call home, what, is that in, what does that kind of bring to your mind? If I were to call and say, hi, Mrs. So-and-so, it's Mr. Coley. 
Okay, unfortunately, the first thing when the principal's calling, usually parents think, uh-oh, what's wrong? Is he in trouble? Is she hurt? Is she sick? It's usually a bad idea, and it doesn't have to be like that. So I'm, I'm doing something called the good news call of the day, and my goal is every single day of this school year, I'm looking to call at least one family for a good reason for something that I'm seeing in classrooms or out on the playground. So I might see somebody showing great character on the playground. I'm going to be calling home to let you know about that because, well, yes, unfortunately, sometimes I do have to call for not the best of reasons, but there are so many good things going on at Alta. You need to know about that. You are raising some good kids, and I want you to know about that. So hopefully I'll be calling you my good news call of the day. So we look, I really, really am looking forward to that this year. And then finally, just a couple reminders about um, our pick up and drop off procedures. Number one, if you are arriving in the morning, remember our gates open at 825 and the lineup bell rings at 845. And remember, if you come in early between that 825 and 845, everyone needs to go straight to the playground area, straight to the blacktop. So we have two entrances, the front gates and then the back turnstile gate. So whichever gate you come in in the morning, you need to either turn right from the front gate or left at the back gate and go straight to the playground until the lineup bell rings. We do not have students going to classrooms to drop off backpacks or anything like that. And the reason is we don't have supervision in the quad area and by classrooms. And we wanna make sure everybody is safe. If a student were to be walking over to a classroom to drop something off and were to trip and fall and bang their head or be injured in some way, there would be no one there to see it and to be able to help out. So the whole purpose of that, of that policy of going straight to the playground is safety, which is our number one concern. And piggybacking on that, parking lot reminders. If you're crossing uh, the parking loop, remember we ask you, please always use the crosswalk. And just, we don't wanna have double parking. I know that the parking situation is not ideal. We don't have enough parking and we ask for your patience. <laughs> it, the lines are long sometimes, so just remember, please do not leave your vehicle unattended. You cannot park in the loop area and get out to go get your child. You're welcome to find parking in our lot. Remember that each afternoon, we typically chain off our lot at about 15 minutes before dismissal. So 2.45 on most days, 1.45 on Mondays. And that's because by that time, all of the parking places have been taken up. And we were finding last year, people were coming in and then double parking, preventing people from getting out of the lot. And also they were encouraging students to kind of rolling their window saying, hey, come across, R run across the street to the car. And again, it's just not safe. So if you want to find a parking spot, be sure to get here before uh, 2.45 or 1.45 on Mondays. And we just ask you, once again, we appreciate your patience. We know it's crowded. The first couple of days and weeks are always worse. So just remember, it will get a little bit better as the year progresses. So once again, thank you so much for watching. Um, I am privileged and blessed to be the principal here at Alta. It is an amazing school and it's an amazing school because of our amazing students, our teachers, and you. Moms, dads, family members, the community. You are what make also you are what makes Alta uh, the amazing schools that it is. So thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day and we'll see you next month.